as why you should. Today I want to talk about something that, when I think about it, isn't entirely applicable yet to me, but I still want to talk about it because it's always at the back of my mind um, at work. And I do want to talk about work. It's kind of obvious because, you know, that's, that's the thing that occupies the, the majority of my time right now. So I, I bring things from, from that world and from work. And uh, it's, it's the subject of routine. Now, it's a problematic, again, it's not applicable for me. It's a problematic subject because, first of all, I'm only there for a month and a half, which isn't a very long amount, period of time. Second, the, the, the specific, the type of job that I'm at, there's so many, there's so many different departments and you keep t talking with so many different people. And also, these projects are, it's, it's mobile game development. So, you know, very long project is like three months is a very long project, I guess. And that's, and then you move on to another project, which is something completely new. So it's not, it doesn't really get dull in that sense. And in addition to that, for me specifically, getting to work every day, which I, I, commuting to work is, is a big aspect of work, I feel. And uh, that has not been stable at all for me because I have a combination of buses and people, different people driving me different parts of the road every day. You know, something else, a different combination of stuff happens. And uh, I'm not, it's not up to me. I'm always a little bit on edge because it's not up to me when I go to work and when I come back because I'm just dependent on these people right now. Hopefully in a bit, I'll have a car and then I'll just, you know, I'll have, I'll do the commute properly every day. But right now it's super hectic. So it doesn't, it doesn't really let me get into a comfort zone in that sense. So yeah, it might not be the most applicable thing to me, but still I want to talk about routine and I want to talk about getting too comfortable in an area. And in one ends, in one hence, one hence, um, in one sense, yeah, in one sense, <laughs> in one sense, it's getting comfortable is a good thing. I mean, you want to get in, you know, it's comfortable, you, comfortable, being comfortable is a good thing. But what I mean when I say comfortable is uh, getting complacent and getting and, and being at a point that it's stale and dull and you don't grow as a person at work at whatever fields that, that you're, you're doing. And that to me is, is something that's really bad. I think it's always important to keep things fresh and interesting and different every day. And all of those things are always at the back of my mind that I keep, I keep trying to do as much as I can out of those things. And it comes down to very stupid things sometimes. As you know, if you need to reach a certain place, um, you just try and, and go in different routes. Uh, it might not be the best route, but it's a different route. So you might bump into someone else in the hallway, you know, something like that. And in addition to that, another big aspect that is, I mean, commute is one thing, but another big aspect that is true for every different work ever is lunch and who you have lunch with. I'm lucky to be in a big company. You know, it's not really in a small store where there's four people. There's not much to say. But if you're in a big company with a lot of people at the same place, then don't always go with your team to the same two places that you guys always go to to have lunch try and do different things try and talk to other people and you know it's a big company so there are people that i don't really have any connection with and i d pretty much never talk to but trying and hey let's have lunch this time with you it's uh, some i don't know take me where you usually go or wh whatever it may be and meeting random people and talking to them it's not random people it's it's in your company and you're in your place of work and that's interesting and awesome and and it's also very very useful to know people from different departments in case you need something you know uh from them but also because it's it becomes stale to just do the same thing every time and luckily i'm also i'm in an area for me specifically i'm in an area where there's a lot of restaurants there's a ton of restaurants a walking distance away so you can always go to different stuff and i've already met people i've already met a lot of people most people that either have like you know, they go every single day to the same place with the same same amount of people, same, like, you know, just the team, the team just goes to the same place every day, and some people even order the same dish every single day. And that, to me, is kind of horrible. You want to keep things as different as possible and as fresh as possible to never get too stale and too comfortable. And, uh, again, it's like, it's totally, now that I'm really talking and, and saying it, it's like so not applicable for me because I... I crazy right now and I'm, I'm, I'm it's like I, I feel that it's my default state not doing those things not getting comfortable it's like my default state it is in the back of my mind the whole time but I don't feel that if it wasn't the back of my mind I wouldn't do it anyways 
I just, I, I try and do something different every day anyways for lunch and commuting and walking through the hallways, you know, the, the, the stupid things. And obviously whatever it, whatever it is that you do for work, it's applicable to, to, you know, depending on what you work at. Um, but yeah, whatever. I guess this would make more sense in four months when I'm more stable, probably. Uh, but yeah, I want to talk about it right now. I'm really having fun. I don't have much more to say. I'm really enjoying my work right now. I'm excited to go to work every day, and I enjoy working every day. And um, I'm, I'm, I'm excited to stay long hours. And w Not that I can, because again, I'm dependent on other people. But I'm having a lot of fun, and I'll probably have more things to say about work as I keep working. <laughs> uh, and I don't, don't plan on stopping anytime soon. So uh, yeah, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.